Welcome back everyone. A little over a week to go to Memorial Day and we are joined this morning by a very special guest, Colonel Lee Ellis, an Air Force pilot who fought in the Vietnam War where his aircraft was shot down over enemy territory and he became a prisoner of war for five years. Thank you so much for joining us this morning, Colonel Ellis. First of all, let me say to you, thank you so much for all that you have done for our country. We thank really appreciate your service. Th thank you, Octavia. So, exciting times for you, huh? It is, very yeah. exciting, Tell yes. me about your new book, Leading with Honor. Well, it's really two books in one. One, it's POW stories about the great leadership we had there, and then the other part is the lessons learned, the leadership lessons learned from that, and so each chapter really has the stories, and then here's the lesson, and here's how that lesson applies in today's workplace. Well, take a look at the cover there. That's pretty different. It's unique. Tell me how all that came about. Well, the cover does grab you, and the cover shows the, uh, the one foot that's uh, kind of scarred and bloodied, and mm -hmm. uh, that's the way my feet were because they took away my boots right after I was captured. And then the other shoe shows all dressed up and ready to go. I think that really represents what leading with honor is about. It requires sacrifice, really, to lead with honor. We, we like to think that we're all honorable, but it's not easy. There are some tough choices you have to make, and that's what I indicate and show in the book, how our leaders made tough choices. They didn't make a decision up in the penthouse for somebody else to carry out. When they made a choice or a policy decision, they went first into the furnace to go be, to stand up for it, and quite often they were tortured first and most often. And so the younger guys like me, we kind of followed in their footsteps and we learned a lot from them. Well, the color certainly makes you stop in your tracks and tugs at your heart. And yes. I guess that was the intention for you to do that. Yes. It wasn't my idea, but I think it was a great idea, yeah, the cover. Yeah, it was. Okay. And tell me about your, your plans for today, why you're here in the Low Country. Yes, I'm here to speak at a, uh, a health care conference out at the Isle of Palms and uh, looking forward to that. It's a wonderful group of people from all over the southeast primarily CEOs and chief financial officers looking at healthcare uh, management and how they can work in the new healthcare world and stay in business and to do a good job. But mainly one thing is to take care of their patients better. Right. Now, Colonel Ellis, you also have ties to the low country as well. Well, my father told me when I was a young boy, my father was a great swimmer and he would tell about lifeguarding at Isle of Palms. And yesterday I came to Isle of Palms for the first time ever. Really? Yeah. How was it for you? Well, it was really neat uh, to come back there and just to think about my, my parents mm -hmm. have both passed away. And of course, they suffered more during my five and a half years as a POW, I think, than I did. We all suffered, but we knew where we were and what was happening, and they didn't know that even I was for sure alive for a couple of years. Have you had a chance to sample some of our food yet? Yes, I have. <laughs> we had uh, baked oysters uh -huh. uh, night before last and all sorts of wonderful food. It's well, been great. We certainly enjoyed having you with us this morning and Thank certainly you. happy that you're paying a visit to the Low Country. And tell everybody where they can pick up your book. Uh, most bookstores will have it. It's just been released this past week. Uh, the online stores like Amazon and Barnes and Noble have it. And leadingwithhonor.com, you can learn a lot more about it. You can actually download a couple of chapters for free on the leadingwithhonor.com website. Okay. Thank you so much again, sir. Thank we you, really Octavia. Appreciate it. Good All being right. with you. Stay with us. We're coming right back.